Welcome to Sugar MDs. Today we are going to talk about medications. Know your medicine series. Today I'm going to talk about Genevia. Now Genevia is one of the most commonly prescribed branded agent after the generic agents. I'm not saying it's the best medication, but it's one of the most commonly prescribed agent just because it has been in the market for a long time. And doctors also prefer this because it is a pill um, and it does not cause low blood sugars. Uh, so as a result, you know, it is, it's, a, it's a common medication. If you're not controlled on Genevia, definitely you may need something stronger. But if you're in Genevia, that YouTube video may help you to understand a little bit better and more about Genevia. And you can decide if you need to stay on Genevia, if you need to move on, uh, it will be up to you and your doctor. Now, Genevia is a uh, medication that allows your body to make insulin. If you're already on insulin, there is no point of being on Genevia because Genevia, practically speaking, maybe will give you three to five units of insulin if you are on insulin. But if you are taking 20, 30 units of insulin per meal, that really is not a medication for you. Uh, generally, it's used for uh, medication naive patients. After metformin, for example, and you're still uncontrolled, you may, you may, if you prefer to use a, a pill, and if you are totally scared of injections, uh, you may prefer to use Genevia if your uh, diet and lifestyle changes are not enough for you. Um, so as I said, uh, that medication will make your body make some more insulin and the way that it does it, uh, it basically inhibits a hormone that destroys the gastrointestinal hormones that your body make. So these gastrointestinal hormones are actually designed to stimulate your pancreas when you eat. Now, these gastrointestinal hormones are, of course, uh, degraded in the body, uh, so your body gets rid of it uh, because you're not constantly eating, hopefully. Uh, so when you eat, your body makes that and then they basically get destroyed. Uh, now, the problem with the patients with diabetes, they don't make enough of that and they are actually resistant to the actions of the, um, the intestinal hormones that they make themselves. So Genevia, prolongs the life of that gastrointestinal hormone that allows you to make more insulin when you eat. Now that's the purpose. Now what are the side effects? So most common side effect is stuffy nose. Some people get stomach pain, some people get headaches, but overall it is a very well tolerated agent. On the label you may see a black box warning that this medication may have caused pancreatic cancer or medullary thyroid cancer in rats, not in human beings. Now since you're not a rat, I will hope that that's not going to happen to you. I'm just kidding. But actually, in human studies, we do not have any evidence to back that up. The animals, the poor animals, uh, they give a lot of, um, maybe a 10 times higher dose than they give to human beings or even higher. These tiny animals, they're already prone to these uh, cancers uh, and they end up getting it. Uh, that doesn't mean that human beings will um, have that problem. Now, on the, on the side note, if you have a family member with pancreatic cancer or, or medullary thyroid cancer, I would be cautious and I would not recommend this medication uh, just out of um, uh, caution and um, you know, uh, to, to be extra, extra careful. Again, um, the benefits we talked about, uh, the other benefit is uh, basically uh, to prevent hyperglycemia, which is low blood sugars. So if you're on glucoside, glimepiride, those type of agents actually can drop your blood sugars quite significantly, especially when you miss a meal. However, when you're on Genevia type of medication, uh, then you will more than likely be just okay, even if you miss meals, uh, as Genevia only activates those gastrointestinal hormones when you eat. If you have any problems with the medications, side effect, the cost, the dosing information, please call us at sugarmds.com. We'll find a way to help you out.